Hi everyone, I've got a challenge for you. I'm going to show you three hands. They've all got 10 points, all the same shape. You've got to tell me which one is the best. One club pass, and I'm going to bid one heart here. North bids two diamonds, two hearts from north. Okay, how good is this hand? And in particular, let's look at the diamond suit. Got king, queen, two of diamonds, and west has bid two diamonds. Okay, that's hand one. This is hand two. This time north opens one club, east bids one diamond, and I'm going to bid one heart. North bids two hearts. Same hand, same shape, same 10 points, but this time east bid one diamond and not west. So how good are those diamonds now? And this is the third hand. North opens one club, east bids one diamond. I bid one heart. North bids two hearts. We've got no points in diamonds. This time I've turned the king of diamonds into the king of spades and the queen of diamonds became the queen of clubs. Still 10 points, still the same shape, still north opened a club. We bid one heart and north bids two hearts. What do you think? Well, we can go some way to solving this by looking at this example, which I always quite like. Suppose we have ace, four, three, two of spades, king, three, two of hearts, queen, three, two of diamonds, and jack, three, two of clubs. How good is that hand? How many tricks are we going to make? We're going to make the ace of spades. doesn't matter what the contract is or the auction, just that looks like a trick. King of hearts, maybe a trick. Queen of diamonds, mm, jack of clubs, really depends on what partners got and what the opposition have got. All right, let's take the same 10 points and put them all together in the same suit. Now, all of a sudden, we seem to have four tricks, ace, king, queen, jack. Those honor cards working together mean that uh, the jack is just as good as the ace. Here, it's working all on its little lonesome. Here, it's got the ace, king, queen to support it. So honors working together is a good thing. Okay, back to our hands. All right, this is the first hand again. And one club, uh, I'm going to put one heart. North bids two diamonds. Sorry, west bids two diamonds. North bids two hearts. This is just bad. King, queen of diamonds is, they're not well placed because west has bid diamonds after us. So uh, west probably has the ace of diamonds. So as soon as we play the king, west is going to play the ace. We'll make the queen but probably only one diamond trick. This is hand two. One club, one diamond, one heart. Two hearts. This looks a lot better because East has probably got the ace of diamonds. And now our king and queen of diamonds are sitting after the ace. So we're probably going to get two diamond tricks. Let's quickly play this hand. I'm just going to pass. North leads a uh, West leads a diamond, and East wins the ace. So that's great. We've got two diamond tricks. And what else? We're going to, well, let's draw some trumps. Um, West roughs. That doesn't matter. I can just over rough. And draw... Some trumps, that's all the trumps gone. Now the club suit and the spade suit, I'm just going to take a couple of finesses here. Play the ace of clubs. And finesse the club, that's the percentage play on this hand. Didn't work, never mind. Um, and let's try the spade finesse. Ah, that didn't work either. But we are going to end up making two hearts.
Right. Now we're going to play the same hand, except we're going to turn the King of Diamonds into the King of Spades and the Queen of Diamonds into the Queen of Clubs. And there it is. The King of Diamonds became the King of Spades. The Queen of Diamonds became the Queen of Clubs. So this time I'll bid one heart. It's sort of kind of, what do you think? The King, Queen of Diamonds, we had two short tricks then. Now we don't have those two diamond tricks. So we're going to lose two diamonds. We're not going to make any diamond tricks. But look how that King of Spades means that we don't have a spade loser. That queen of spades is actually going to make a trick. Look at the queen of clubs. Because it's working, look at those clubs now. Ace, king, queen, jack. All those club honours are working together. Um, sure, we don't make any diamond tricks, but we get those tricks back with interest because our points are now working together. Now, we're going to, um, I'll just play this one out quickly. And we still lose those two diamonds and we still lose the ace of hearts. But this time we are going to make 10 tricks. And there's not a thing anybody can do about it. So when we're looking at our points, we certainly would rather have our honours sitting after our opposition who's bid that suit. But best of all, we want our honours working together in the same suit. Look at that beautiful hand. Look at how well those honours work together. Ten tricks. Hope you found that helpful. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.